What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Okay, so it is time to go to the gym yet again. I'm gonna take on some guy named Bugsy, although I honestly thought he was a girl. I mean, he doesn't, the, yeah, the short shorts and the hair does not do him justice, so enough about that. Let's, uh, first, this, first, first and foremost, we gotta get some healing items, because... Really, we've been lacking in the whole uh, healing potions and stuff. And since we've been earning money, you know, it's like good enough, good enough time to actually get ourselves some potions right here. So we're gonna get five potions, and yeah, just, just three super potions. That's good enough right there. Okay, and uh, really, Joey the youngster. No, I don't have a minute. Leave me alone, Joey. Oh God. Stop talking. I don't care that you beat a spin rack. Jesus, the guy... Okay, you know what? Let's see. Poke gear. Okay. Delete. Yeah, that way that, that way he doesn't call us anymore. Because that, 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 it gets annoying. He really calls us every single time for no apparent reason. <sighs> somebody has to break the trend. Seriously, somebody has to. And, uh, well, look at that. Slowpoke, he's like... Yawn. Where's the rain? Where's the rain? There's no rain. Okay, so here we go. Azalea City Gym, and, or Azalea Town Gym, and he's like, Yo, Ch Challenger, Bugsy, Bugsy's young, but his knowledge of bug Pokemon is for real. It's going to be tough without my advice. Let's see. Bug Pokemon don't like fire. Flying uh, type moves are super effective, too. Hmm. You think? I do have a flying type Pokemon, but I don't necessarily have a flying type attack, and nobody's ahead of me right now, so I'm going to use every single one of my Pokemon right here. I think every single one of them are, like, really close to leveling up, so let's do this. There's no double battles. He's like, you want to see the leader? We come first. Okay. All right. Bring it on. Just bring it. Bring it on, ladies. So here we go, twins Amy and May, and they come out with a ladybug right here. Okay, you're looking pretty, uh, pretty awesome right there. So let's go with uh, Mud Slap. I do think ground type moves are effective against, uh, against uh, what you call it, against bug types, right? Are they? Ah, it doesn't affect them. Okay, so Plan B, Water Gun. I don't want to be the uh, the one that gets beaten by a ladybug. Never been beaten by a ladybug. It's a weak Pokemon, and wow, does not take that much damage. Oh Jesus! There's that slam attack, and yeah, that takes a good amount. Okay, okay, we're working with magic right here. And here we go again with another slam attack. Thank you, slam attack. Saved our butts. Level 12. And uh, we're still slow, slow as molasses, and it's gonna come out with a spin rack, so let's go with Toxic Batman. I am Batman. Toxic Batman. I don't know. So, let's go right ahead and use that bite attack, now that we have an extra move that can, that works. And, uh, well, that slow, that scary, scary face move does not work. Doesn't lower our sp well, there it is again. And we lose a lot of speed right there. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and use that bite attack. Oh, come on. Should have beaten him right there and then. Come on. And that is how... And that is how you do it. Look at that. Level 13 Toxic Batman. Toxic Batman does some stuff. Look at that. Alrighty. Okay, okay, so that's the end of those girls, and uh, let's see, let's go with, nope, I don't want to use my egg as a Pokemon starter, <laughs> okay, so let's go with Teddy right here, and battle this person right here, let's see, bug Pokemon are cool and tough, I'll prove it to you right now, okay, alright. Alright, let's do this. Bug Pokemon. Bug Pokemon are not that strong. But yet they're very vulnerable, so go with that scratch attack. 
Should be easy. Hmm. They like, they do like to lower your stats. They do like to uh, uh, screw with your stats too. Um, well, they do like to affect you with like poison or paralysis and stuff. But I don't think any of these Pokemon do that right here, except for probably uh, Bugsy's Pokemon. Likes to poison you maybe. And here he comes out with the Weedle. So let's go with uh, let's go with Lucky. Come on, Lucky. You can do this. Do it for your ladies. Do it for all your ladies. And uh, water gun attack. Ooh, there's that poison scene. Not that effective. But in if I if I don't beat this Pokemon real quick, it might poison me eventually. And that is another one right there. Luckily, we don't get poisoned. Might take a uh, shot in the dark with that mud slap. So let's go ahead and see if that works. Jesus. Stop. Poison. And. Okay, it's not that super effective, but it's lowering its accuracy. And that doesn't do anything at all, which is good. Works at the perfect timing. There we go. Oh, come on. This is like a chess game right there. Okay. Bye bye Look at that. Look at that. Easy. Easy stuff right there. So there's another Pokemon trainer down. It's like you proved how tough you were. I know, right? So let's see. I gotta check out some, some stuff right here. Okay, so you already grew a level. You already grew a level. You're about to grow a level. And you're, you're, you're about to hatch. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go one more time with Toxic Batman. I'm gonna save Cinder right now for for the main battle. And uh, hopefully I can get, I can breeze through uh, Bugsy because Bugsy, again. Oh wait, there's one right there. I know there's another one right here somewhere. Yes, right there. Okay, so we got like two trainers left. Okay, I'm not gonna read this guy's uh, montage, but I'm gonna beat him. I'm gonna beat him badly. I'm gonna make him uh, angry. So here we go. Paras. Hmm. Paras. Okay, so I'm gonna do this. I gotta be strategic about this. Stretch a stretch a mitchifik or something. And uh, it hurts itself. Good, good, good. Okay, so let's get that bite. Hopefully it flinches. Please let it flinch. It is confused, but it's not flinching. And uh, it does have scratch attack, which don't want to mess with, especially with a Paris. Well, maybe with the Paris. It's not that strong. Here we go again. Flinch, flinch, flinch. Yes, it's flinching. And that's how you beat a Paris with a Toxie Batman. There we go. It actually looks like the Batman logo. I kid you not, it looks like the Batman logo. And we got one more guy right there, so let's go with Teddy. Little Teddy Ursa. I'm gonna go right here. Talk to him, and he's like, Bug Pokemon Evolved is so young. So they get stronger that much faster. Hmm. Yeah, but then that's like their peak. That is definitely their peak. And here we have Bug Catcher Benny coming out with his Weedle. Alrighty. Let's go, Teddy. Let's win this. Let's be men. Well, you're a female, but let's... You know, you know exactly what I mean. And uh, coming out with a Kakuna. Okay, so this might be a little tougher because its defense is pretty high. But it's, I can hack it. Look at that. Hack it with some scratch. Come on, finish him off. Hack him with some scratch. Hakuna Katu Hakuna Kat Matata. And we got one more. And wow, B drill. Okay, so this is gonna be a challenge right here because B drill is actually a little faster than than Teddy. Fully evolved Pokemon. Let's go with that lick attack. Hopefully, it does something. But that Fury attack is ooh, it's unforgiving right here. This guy's going for five. Jesus. Okay. All right. I see where I, I, I see you. Paralyzed. Paralyzed. Oh, come on. Oh, that fury attack is unforgiving. Come on. Okay. That was three. Come on. Par paralysis. 
Paralysis. No paralysis. Let's finish him off with some scratch. And that's the only move you actually ha have. Ooh. Yeah, that the next one is not going to be perfect. But critical hit beats you. Oh, yeah. How do you like my teddy now? Kicked your butt, and look at that. Fury swipes. Oh, well, look at that. How do you like my Teddy Ursa, guys? How do you like him now? Or her? Okay, so... Good for you. Good for you. Let's leave it all up to Cinder right now. Alright, so there's... The dude that I thought was a chick. He's like, I'm Bugsy! I never lose when it comes to po bug-type Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority on bug Pokemon. Let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies. Okay. Alrighty, buddy. Let's do this. Look at that. Leader Bugsy wants the battle. Leader Bugsy sends out Metapod. Alright, coming out with that Metapod right there. Okay, so switching on to our next screen right here. It is really nothing different, guys. In all three versions, in Gold, Silver, and Crystal, Bugsy uses a level 14 Metapod, level 14 Kakuna, and a level 16 Scyther. Now the thing you have to learn about this is that both Metapod and Kakuna actually do have their uh, their physical moves that they learn as Caterpillar Pokemon. Uh, Metapod has Tackle, String Shot, and Harden, while Kakuna has Poison Sting, String Shot, and Harden. Now when you face Scyther, now that is a fast Pokemon right there. It does have Fury Cutter, Quick Attack, and Leer. You gotta be careful for that Fury Cutter because every single time it attacks, it gets a lot stronger. So going back to this screen right here, let's just burn this guy up. Burn him up. That's right. Finish off the Metapod right here. This is this is gonna be easy stuff. Cinder, kick him butt. Kick him butt everywhere. And grows to level 18. Look at that. Okay. Coming out with that Kakuna. I'm not gonna switch. I'm just gonna beat you down with this uh, with this Cinder right here. Again with another Ember attack right here. Ooh, I love that sound. This guy has no chance whatsoever. Alrighty, alrighty, and here comes the big dog, it, Scyther. How many times have you ever battled a Scyther in the original versions? Not so many times, and I'm actually glad that they have them right here. Just remember, Scyther is a very, very fast Pokemon. As you can see, it's using its Fury Cutter. It gets stronger every single time. And there is that Flamethrower, or that Ember Attack. Ooh, super effective. There it goes again with that Fury Cutter. Takes a little more HP, but here's that Amber attack, hopefully for the win. And there goes Scyther. Easy. Too easy. And Cinder grows to level 19. Very, very good stuff. So as you can see, Leader Bugsy has been defeated. Whoa, amazing. You're an expert upon Pokemon. My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you win. Take this badge. We got a lot of money off of that stuff. That's some good stuff. So here it is, guys, our second badge, the Hive Badge. Do you know the benefits of the Hive Badge? If you have it, or if you have it, Pokemon up to level 30 will obey you, even traded ones. Pokemon that no cut will be able to use it outside of battle too. Here, also, I, I also want you to have this, and it is the TM49 Fury Cutter. Same move that you tried to defeat us with. And he's like, contains Fury Cutter, if you don't miss, it gets stronger every turn. The longer your battle goes, the better it gets. Isn't that great? I discovered it. Huh, good for you, I guess. Bug Pokemon are deep. There are many mysteries to the to be explored. Study your favorite poke, uh, your favorites thoroughly. Nah, not really. Not really, because I like all Pokemon, not just bugs. Alrighty, okay, so I'm feeling awesome, feeling great. Ten episodes, and we got two badges, and this guy's like, well done! That was a great clash of talented young trainers. With people like you, the future of Pokemon is bright. Probably, and yeah, we're the only ones here. Winning trainers, Draven. Suck it. Hey Gary, wherever you're at, I'm flipping you off because I'm dominating Johto. So, stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we will be going to the Alex Forest, doing a lot of stuff, beating some bug-type Pokemon, and, yeah, trying to get to Goldenrod City. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.